The Kenya powerlifting team landed in Dubai last night for the para powerlifting Paralympic Games qualifiers. The team of two female athletes carry the hopes of Kenya qualifiers as the top ranked athletes chasing Paralympics qualifications. Let's get more from our very own Mike Okini. It has been a tough six months for these two powerlifters since they started their training amid the coronavirus pandemic. With the closure of sports facilities and suspension of sports in Kenya, they were forced to train in isolation and at home to comply with the COVID-19 protocols. It depends on how you have prepared your team. And as I've been monitoring my athletes, I think they are going to do better. Helen Wawira will compete in the under 41 kg category. She has been in the sport for seven years now and has adapted to the new norm of training in isolation at a base in Embu. Qualification to Tokyo is her priority. For Joyce Wamboy, 10 years of competing has taught her to be patient ahead of a major competition. She says working with coach Lena Nyaboke after the suspension of sports was lifted has helped her prepare better for the Dubai qualifiers. The two athletes are the best in the country right now with a top 10 global ranking. The technical bench believes they stand a good chance of making it because their consistent performance has boosted their ranking. Once you are in the top eight, you qualify to travel to Tokyo. And uh, we hope with the preparation we have, they are in good health. Be part of your vaccine. The Dubai competition is the last qualifier for the Tokyo Paralympic Games. Michael Kenyi for Citizen TV.